Hi. Okay, so this is me and my PJs getting ready to go to bed. And I decided that I wanted to talk about men. Um, I'm tired of it. I know it's, whoa, you mean you're tired of it? Like, no, I'm tired of it. Like, there's, I'm a good girl. And there's a lot of good girls out there. If you're a dog and you're a player and you just want to do this, find a hoe. There's enough hoes out there for you to have your fun with than for you to ruin a good woman. Now, I'm not saying this because anything's happened to me because it hasn't. But I've witnessed it too many times and I'm over it. And I'm telling you guys, there are girls that have boyfriends that want to cheat on their boyfriends. There are girls that don't give a shit about anybody but themselves. Fuck with those hoes. Okay? And if you're offended, it's because you're a hoe. Okay? You're the hoe. So, why don't you go find these guys instead of ruining the good men for us good women? Okay, good should be with good and bad should be with bad. And if you have a problem with that, then you need to just bleh. Okay? Because I'm over it. I'm so over it. A good woman is a good woman. And if you have no intention of honoring that good woman, leave her alone. Just walk away. And if she's like, what I like, be like, no, I'm a bad dude. And I'm only going to hurt you and then ruin you. And that's it. So I'm just going to walk away and be with some other girl that can handle my badness. And say that. And, and believe me, with time, that woman will appreciate it. But stop messing with the good ones. Because what's going to happen that you're not really aware of because bad boys don't even think is that when you're ready for a good one, when you're done playing all your games, when you're done with all, there won't be any good girls left because you ruined all of them. So just leave the good ones alone. Leave us alone. Bad boys, stay away from us. Go be with whatever tricks or hoes or freaks that you need to be with. And if you have a girlfriend, what is wrong with you? If you have a girlfriend, don't mess with a single woman who's looking for love. Because that's the worst thing that you can do to somebody. If you have a girlfriend, screw with another girl that has a guy. Don't be messing with a single girl that's hoping and praying that you'll choose her. Don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, if you have issues, you have issues. You end whatever relationship you're in to get into the next one. So, wake up. Stop playing games. Stop messing with people's hearts. Because it's not just their hearts, it's their heads. And then it's how they raise their children. It's how they affect other people. It's the advice that they give other people. You're causing much more damage because you're dick. And this is for the hoes out there too because there's a lot of hoes that mess with really good men. You know, because they're just playing them for the money or they're playing them for whatever reason because they just have that ego trip and they want to know that they can get them but they really love the bad boys. Like you hoes are just as bad as these guys. So this goes both ways. I'm not just like hounding on one person. And then for you people that are bi, same deal. Stop playing with people's hearts. Be straight up. Let them make the decision of whether or not they want to be with you. And if they do and they get hurt, well, you know what? That's their problem. But don't mess with someone's heart. Don't mess with someone's head. It's just, you know, not to mention the karma that's going to come back around. So if you're one of these people, sit down, think about it. You're going to sit there and be like, oh, well, whatever. To you, too. But at least you heard it. Because if you hear it, then it'll make you think about it the next time you do it. And if you hear it enough times after a while, you'll start making better decisions. And you know what? There's not enough of us that are telling people good advice so many times that the person hears it to the point where they start making good decisions. This is why the world is falling apart the way it is. Because we stopped caring about telling people what the right thing to do. Right is right and wrong is wrong. And you know right from wrong. But you know what? If you get away with it enough times, you start thinking that wrong is right. But it's not. Wrong is wrong. It might be perception. It might, it might be how you feel. Like whatever. I don't care. All I'm saying is stop messing with the good ones. Because the good ones are the only thing that's keeping this world right. And the more you mess with them, the more you're ruining everything. Because when they're gone, they're gone. So wake up and leave them alone.